Lakeisha, do you feel that the public understands you as an essential part of the economy right now? I don't think so. <laughs> like, um, I can give you like examples when, so like now I'm noticing a lot of the Amazon, um, the Amazon uh, commercials or, um, I mean, the grocery store people, I love my grocery store people. I think they're amazing. Um, I love my Amazon because I'm still able to get my prime thing. So don't get me wrong. I, I love them. Um, but in order to, for those people to go to work, for those doctors or those lawyers or, or the nurses, um, they have to have childcare if they need it. Some, like for myself personally, when I moved here, I didn't have any family. So we actually have one of our parents, she's a nurse, she's an um, a delivery nurse at the hospital. So she has to go to work. She's essential. And she has no family. Her husband is in the military and he's deployed. So it's just her and her kid. So if we weren't here, that couldn't happen. So I don't, I feel like I'm important. You know, I know I'm important. I say it every day when I get up and I come into work. I, I tell Kelly this all the time. I am legend. I get up, I get in my car and I roll in right um and i feel i feel special and i don't think that people know that i feel like even on a good day um early ed workers were not as um prioritized and now going back to us teaching those kids and providing care for those firefighters and those nurses and those doctors um it's like well who's keeping their kids they're not in the corner you know watching the iPads or whatever, they're here and we are creating, um, when all of this noise settles, the children won't realize the noise was there because of us, because we've created happiness and laughter and joy and memories amongst all of this. And I think that's something that we don't get applauded for. Just, you know, and I don't think us, I know what Small Miracles, we get on our conference call and we hype each other up, like we are our own hype you know, women, but I think I would love a commercial, right? I would love a Facebook post, right? You know, I would love those type of things and I don't need them because I see the faces um, of the kids. And I know at the end of the day, when COVID-19 2020 goes away, the kids won't have a clue and I'm okay with that. So to answer your question, we could just use a little bit more high five, elbow, you know, or something. <laughs> And I think they forget that we are essential too. And it's, it's heartbreaking. I want more recognition, like a thank you, or because you see, keep seeing it out there too. Like what Keisha said, you see the groceries. I want to thank everybody that's out there doing everything for us, but they forget childcare and we are, we start them from birth and we grow with them. We're here from day one. We had, we're still doing trainings. We're still, um, now we went from training in like sites just last night. Um, my staff was, my team of amazing women were on a Zoom call from 6.30 to like 8.15 at night in their home. So not only are we continuing our work here, we're continuing training for them at home. And these gals are not only stepping up and being present every day, like I have not had any call out since all of this happened, but they're also going home and selling their families and still checking in. They're still, they're just not checking the boxes. They're doing the work. And we have to, I mean, we thank them. Like one of the things we do as a team is who are you appreciating? You know, that's one of our things. Like it's on our call list for today. Who are you appreciating this week? Um, and a lot of us has been appreciating our whole staff because we don't want them to um, forget that they are valued. Um, that they are the core of who we are. And as a director, I couldn't do this without them.